A dog rescuer, a wildlife rescuer, pooling their knowledge to save a three-week-old bird stranded in a parking lot. NBC 10's Maya Hudgens back from talking with the raptor rehabilitator who currently is taking care of this bird. Hey, Maya. Gordon, the type of bird found is a Mississippi kite. They make Louisiana their homes during the summer months, but by the end of this month, they spread their wings and fly back to Central America. That's what this raptor rehabilitator is hoping for this little guy as well. Tuesday, August 6th, animal rescuer Shan Hagen got a call about a baby bald eagle being stranded in a hot parking lot. She said, oh my goodness, Shannon, there is a baby eagle underneath the car at my workplace and I have to leave. What do I do? But after getting in contact with the only raptor rehabilitation center in this area, she found out it was a Mississippi kite. He looked like he was dehydrated. Maybe he had been there for a while. Um, he didn't put up much of a fight when I went to get him. It's unknown how this three-week-old kite was abandoned. There wasn't a mama bird calling or any nearby trees. Typically, a lot of these birds are injured when, they, when they're brought to me. They have broken wings or legs or things like that. This little guy was lucky enough to have no injuries. However, he could have an infection that makes eating very difficult. It has something going on with, in his throat, so I'm going to take it to my veterinarian's office today and let them help me diagnose that. Mississippi kites come here to do their breeding, but leave after the summer is over which means this guy has to be ready to take flight in just a couple of weeks. I've raised quite a few of these and, and released them. And they seem like they, they just uh, instinctively know how to take care of themselves. These raptors aren't endangered but are protected by the Migratory Bird Treaty Act, meaning they can't be killed, hunted, captured, or sold unless the person has a federal permit. I'm so happy that he's in the best place um, to have the best outcome he can have. Before the release happens, the kite will need to grow some more, stretch his wings, and practice flying. If you hear a beautiful whistle from the sky, it's probably a Mississippi kite. In the studio, Maya Hudgens, NBC 10, your local news leader.